okay so in this video i'm going to talk about how to get free hosting and domain to be able to practice if you have an intention to design your own website you can go ahead and then start designing but what i encourage is that mm -hmm. you rather try a free hosting and domain practice what we are going to teach you in this master class first and then when you are done and you are abreast with the panel you would what start designing your website so practice makes perfect so if you need um, a free domain for practice you go to infinity free okay it's infinity free so we go to infinityfree.com i'll put the link in the description to this video okay infinityfree.net infinityfree.net free hosting with php so free hosting okay you can have free hosting okay so free web hosting so completely free website hosting with php my sql and no ads on your site okay so you agree so this will pop up then you click on agree so you are going to register for free hosting in domain so free hosting this is only for practice purpose okay so let's sign up okay let's sign up so you sign up you provide your email address so I'm providing my email address Then the password I want to use for this site, okay. Okay, so the, with the password, let me enter. So you click I have read and agreed to the terms of service. Then you create new account. Okay. So they said that they've sent what a verification link to this. Okay. So I check my verification. Okay. Okay, so now it has come. Okay. So, verify email address. Okay, so let's verify our email address. Okay, so it's verified. Okay, so let's log in to our account let's log into our account so with the email address that we used to register Okay, so the password, we enter the password that you used to register. Then lo let's log in. Okay. Okay. So, 
we agree okay so now we've gotten to hosting accounts so we want a free hosting account to be able to host our website or to start designing our website so what do we do you create account okay so you click on create account so now let's go to subdomain please don't go to this side custom domain is that you want um, a domain that you purchase we just want a free domain okay so we want just a subdomain so we type anything that we want so anything that you want so I'm coming to write type something okay so this is a subdomain that we want it's just for practice sake so I chose this subdomain extension so our domain is nana.infinityfreeapp.com let's search the domain if it is available so you have to search if the domain is available wow the domain is available it means that no one has ever registered like or come for a domain name like this so these are domain names so anytime we type this into our browser we will get to this site okay so it's nana.infinity.freeapp dot com so I'm trying to write it down so that I will not forget so create hosting account okay so it's available so I've chosen the domain name now enter additional information then step three done okay its name will be nana so a website name is equal to domain so if you hear domain it, or domain name it means your website's name what people will just type and then they will be able to access your website for example maybe um amazon.com do you get it they will just that's amazon the company's name is amazon and then when they type amazon.com they are able to reach okay the website or the place the amazon company their site so this is my website nana.infinityfreeapp.com so this is a free domain okay then account username okay unique password so all this will be generated for me so i'm creating a hosting account creating a hosting account then you say create account so they will generate the username and the password to me automatically so my account has been created with username so this is my username so i can copy it i can copy it so I've, i'll copy it and put it on my notepad i can save it on my notepad you can save it anywhere but i prefer the notepad it could be your word so username So my username is okay so and then my password is okay so I can open my control panel my account has been created So you can open control panel or you can okay let's view here before we open control panel okay so i'm checking my password you see so this is my password so anytime i want to log in to get my password i will have to so let me Okay, so I want to add my password. It's very important. I want to save this on my on my desktop so that I can save.
save my password here. Okay. So I'm saving it. Infinity free details. Infinity free details. Details. So I'm saving. So anytime I come here, I'll be able to log on. So the control panel is where you come and then you can access everything with relation to your site. Okay, so now that we viewed client area. So our website name, remember, is nana.infinityfreeapp.com. This is our main domain. The main domain is this. And the website IP hosting volume. So we can just always come here. When we log into our account, and you can find this. Okay. So let's go to our control panel. Control panel. Exactly. Exactly. So hi, Epistes. To notify you of changes to service accounts, offers, and other important service in the repair. We, per we need permission to send you email. Click I approve below to allow us. Alternatively, choose with no email alerts, which may cost you to lose your account. Okay, so I approve. Okay, so if you don't approve, your panel, your control panel will not load. And what is a control panel? A control panel is where, or the back end, where you assess the back end of your site. Anybody that gets access to this control panel of your website, you are dead and gone. The person can manipulate your website. So don't share your username and the password with anybody. Don't share your username and your password with anybody. So when you get a free hosting, if this is just for practice sake, if you would want to buy hosting and domain, you can just check in the description of this video and then you can just click there are so many hosting and domains um, that if you click on one you can be able to access and then buy your domain okay from there so in some subsequent videos i would share how to purchase a domain from some of the domain sites and the hosting sites so kindly subscribe to be able to have access whenever I post a video on this master this is a master class where I share anything that will help your business only things that are help, will help your business that's what I'll share I'll share courses free courses I'll share paid courses affiliate courses and every course here so subscribe to get access let's continue so on our control panel we see preferences so contact email Okay, so our contact email is the email that they'll contact us with our account settings, file manager. So file manager is where you can upload any site and start editing. Okay, so we have add-on domains. You can add on domains and then you can also have subdomains. Redirects, you can also have an email account you can have forwarders we'll, we'll come into details I'll do all these things with you so that you'll be able to practice okay so this is software close any app that you want to install from plugins from teams WordPress PHP Zoomla everything I'll get into details one by one so that you'll be able to understand all these you get it from software class domain types tutorials so if you need any assistance there are free tutorials you can learn a lot over here so if you do not understand websites and PHP when you come here you would be able to assess there are 14 topics if you don't understand anything about how to manage your account if you don't understand anything about domains if you don't understand anything about HTTPS and access so you can come here you have nine topics pending that you can learn how to get started there are six topics here my SQL database you will come into all this one by one okay but for today let's go to websites and PHP okay so you can learn a lot from this 
okay so in my next video so in my next video what i will do is that i'm going to go further into this we will design logos we will design banners for our website we will design what we call favicon for our website we will go through all those things and how to install some of the themes and plugins for our website so subscribe to have access to all this as we do infinity free so this is how to get hosting in this video tutorial we were able to what register for infinity free to get free hosting for our site we were able to configure and get to our C panel. So C panel is like the back end, just like you have your phone, you have Play Store, you have App Store, where you can go and get apps that can change the functionality of your phone. That is what the C panel is. So in this video, we'll also be able to access our C panel. You'll be able to see where we will go to be able to access what our free apps for tutorials and then in the next video we'll go into details and start designing a website okay so see you in my next video don't forget to subscribe bye